84 that came in, we ended up selecting 50 that we were able to award. 48 across the United States, including uh, Alaska and Hawaii. Responsible for the safe return of the asteroid. So could you give us a, a bit of background about why why you chose this vehicle? Apollo 13. We're looking at the 50th anniversary so 13, they made a movie out of, it. of the Apollo sure, missions. Apollo. At least the, the ones that got us from our first one, liftoff, that was Apollo 7 that I flew. Uh, to Apollo 11 for the first landing on the moon. And I find it a little surprising, but mostly just so encouraging to see the population at, at large well, excited lost another, about that happening. Um, time to get that square away. Because it's hard. It's we are certainly at the beginning of this great and adventure so in the sense that there is infinity in front of us and we've opened the door and we've gone through it. So, I mean, uh, this adventure is going to go on for a long, long time, uh, you, you know, leaving the Earth and moving out into the larger cosmos is what Apollo did. And that's not going to stop. I mean, we, we may have slowed down a little bit, but the future, frankly, is infinite. I think they should know how hard we worked. You know, everybody. There's 400,000 people working on Project Apollo. And uh, believe me, a 40-hour work week was a vacation in those days. Like I said, we flew 10 missions in 20 months on Gemini. And then once we started Apollo, uh, we flew in nine months, five missions, and four of them on the big Saturn. To do true exploration of three different sites. And we did. Uh, themselves in 2010, NASA authorization 